Hey everyone, how's it going? If you notice, I'm missing my 4 gig rig. It's no longer up here. And I'm also missing four of my 8 gig cards. I still have four more going. And I also moved my uh, Xeon 5 system down here and consolidated. But they're not gone yet. Actually, they'll be gone tomorrow. Right now, they are up here. Because tomorrow, I got a nice long trip to go from Delaware to North Carolina so I can go and visit Tar Heel Crypto Yankee. He's new on the scene and I am selling him all of this except this motherboard. That's the freebie that I'm sending him. He doesn't know he's getting that yet. He'll find out tomorrow. And also down below I have a 24 inch Dell monitor, regular 1080p, 60 hertz that I no longer use. He can put it to work. So I'm also giving him that as a freebie. Now, some people might be wondering, why the heck am I selling this? Everything still works perfectly fine, and they're all good cards. Uh, I am not FOMOing out. Right now, I'm gonna put that out there, I am not pulling a FOMO. Uh, if anything, I am retooling. I am planning more for the future, and I want to take the money from this sale. So, what I'm after is ergo mining for the future, and I'm also after a little bit more of the 5700 XTs, if I can find them at a good price for Ethereum mining, instead of having a ton of good but low speed cards, I want to go more hash density. I want higher hash cards. Um, and of course, some people were like, well, why don't you just get the NVIDIAs? Well, the thing is, I can get Vega 56s for four or $500 used. Whereas even with the prices going down on cards right now, you're still for a 3070, you're looking at a grand. And that's before the LHR crap. So I'm going for price versus hash rate and I like AMD better than Nvidia anyway. Personal preference, nothing against Nvidia because uh, if we look over here, my gaming and editing, editing rig. Yep, I do have one and it does rave when I'm not doing anything with it. That's just a regular vanilla Dual fan 3060 from EVGA. So I have nothing against NVIDIA. I just prefer AMD for mining. So I am retooling, but right now let's get this into the back of my car. This way it's nice and safe for the travels. So let's get back of the car. One, two, three. And there we go. Everything's packed up in here, except for the screen sitting right there. So about three o'clock tomorrow morning, we get hit the road and we will meet up with Tar Heel down in North Carolina. So after playing in the rain and the traffic for seven hours, made it safely down to North Carolina. And for the man of the hour, here he is right now, most of him, Tar Heel Crypto. Go ahead and pop that trunk because that's got all your goodies in it. And the Zotac box is your surprise. Wow. That was the extra part that was not part of the deal. Nice. We'll have to unbox that in a little bit. Sure. But right now, let's get everything inside before it feels like raining some more. So you have an XFX ARCS 580 8 gig pump. And this one's an MSI. It's also a, a 580 8 gig? Yep. Okay. So that's. that's all this is going really right. great. He originally started on this unit right here. So he's got himself a ZSX breakout board like I've shown on my channel before. And this is a regular 1200 watt power supply. He's got an H110 Pro. Was it H110 Pro? Yep. H110 BTC Pro. BTC Plus. Yep. BTC Plus motherboard on here. Um, oh, you're even running uh, is that SATA or uh, NVMe? NVMe. Oh, it is. That's NVMe. the one you burn to in your video oh, oh that's right okay this when i show the video on how to transfer from usb to nvme or ssd this is actually the motherboard and everything i did remotely for him i even still have the corrupted usb drive oh geez throw it out <laughs> um but he's on a regular beta frame that he hasn't had a chance to quite finish all the way he already has two um rx 588 gigs on here so we're going to add in three of my RX 588 gigs and one RX 578 gigs. Finish up the rack, prime out the fans and get everything running for them.
691 watts. Not bad for having five of the six cards running right now. This last one we don't have running because he was bitten by the bug of a bad GPU riser. So he's got to order more so we can't get the six card running. But we have five of the six running. You can hear the power supply. She's a little loud right now because we're kind of at the 80% rule right now at 120 volts. Once he gets his 240 volt line ran, he will have more capacity on this power supply. The fan will calm down. He can also run this six GPU perfectly fine. So almost done, but still a work in progress. So we're gonna move on to setting up my old four gig rig for him and get that hashing. So you've already seen the almost completed eight gig rig now. And here's my old four gig rig sitting nice and low. So this way it stays cool. And she's all up and running. She went through the travel of seven hours in my trunk with no problems whatsoever. So he also has it mining Ergo and Zill just like I did. So it continues the legacy. So thanks for watching. Thumbs up, please. Come visit us in the Mining Misfit Discord. And we will catch you on the next video.